Dialogue 1. Discussing Favorite Genres. Hey, it's good to see you. Same here, what brings you? Just browsing, love this place. Me too, what genre do you like? I'm into mystery novels, and you? Romance, I love a good love story. Interesting, any recommendations? The Notebook is a classic. I've heard of that one. What about you, any mystery books? The Girl on the Train is great. I've read that one, loved it. What do you like about romance? The happy endings, they're heartwarming. I prefer the suspense in mysteries. I can see why, it's thrilling. Have you read any mystery books? Not really, any recommendations? Gone Girl is a must read. I've heard of that one, thanks. What do you think of ebooks? I prefer physical books and you? Same here, I love the smell. Me too, it's nostalgic. Do you have a favorite author? Nicholas Sparks, he's amazing. I like Agatha Christie's work. She's a classic, I should read her. What's your favorite Sparks book? The Last Song is my favorite. I haven't read that one yet. You should, it's beautiful. What's your favorite Christie book? Murder on the Orient Express. That's a great one, I love it. Who's your favorite detective? Hercule Poirot, he's brilliant. I like Miss Marple, she's clever. Have you read, and then there were none? No, is it good? It's amazing, you should read it. I will, thanks for the recommendation. Do you like book adaptations? Yes, I love seeing the story come to life. Me too, have you seen Gone Girl? No, is it good? It's great, the movie is intense. I'll have to watch it then. What's your favorite book to movie adaptation? The Notebook is my favorite. That's a good one. Me too, it's so romantic. Have you read the book? Yes, it's even better than the movie. I'll have to read it then. You should, it's worth it. Do you have any other favorite romance books? Pride and Prejudice is a classic. I've heard of that one, is it good? It's amazing, you should read it. I will, thanks for the recommendation. No problem, happy reading. Same to you, see you soon. Dialogue 2. Finding a specific book. Excuse me, can you help me? Of course, what are you looking for? I'm looking for a book. What's the title or author? It's called To Kill a Mockingbird. Ah, that's a classic. Do you know the author? Yes, Harper Lee. Great, let's head to the fiction section. Thank you, I appreciate it. No problem, we'll find it. Do you have any other books by Harper Lee? Yes, we have Go Set a Watchman. I've heard of that one, is it good? It's a great read, have you read To Kill a Mockingbird? No, it's for my daughter's school project. Ah, uh, I see. Here it is, To Kill a Mockingbird. Thank you so much, you're a lifesaver. You're welcome, happy reading.
Do you have any recommendations for similar books? Yes, The Catcher in the Rye is a classic. I've heard of that one. Is it good? It's a great read. You should check it out. I will. Thanks for the recommendation. No problem. Have a great day. Wait, I have one more question. Sure, what's up? Do you have any books on parenting? Yes, we have a parenting section. What kind of book are you looking for? Something about raising teenagers. The Teenage Brain by Francis Jensen is a great book. That sounds perfect. Where can I find it? It's in the parenting section. Let me show you. Thank you so much. You're very helpful. No problem. Happy to assist. Dialogue 3 Meeting an Author Hi, it's so great to meet you. Hi, it's great to meet you too. I'm a huge fan of your work. Thank you, I really appreciate that. What inspired you to write your latest book? I was inspired by a true story I heard. That's really interesting. Can you tell me more? It's about a woman who overcomes great adversity. That sounds like a powerful story. I hope you enjoy it. What's your writing process like? I usually write in the morning when my mind is fresh. Do you have any writing rituals? I always have a cup of coffee by my side. That's a great idea. I might try that. It helps me stay focused. Can you sign my book? Of course. What's your name? It's Jane. To Jane, happy reading. Thank you so much. This means a lot to me. It's my pleasure. Thank you for coming. Can we take a photo together? Sure, let's do it. Thank you so much. This is a dream come true. You're welcome. It was great meeting you. Same here. Have a great day. You too. Take care. Dialogue 4 Choosing a Gift Hi, I'm looking for a gift for my friend's birthday. Sure. What kind of book does your friend like? She loves mystery novels and historical fiction. We have a great selection of both. Let me show you. Thank you. That would be great. How about The Name of the Rose by Umberto Eco? That sounds interesting. What's it about? It's a historical mystery set in a medieval monastery. That sounds perfect. I think she'll love it. Great. Let me wrap it up for you. Do you have any other recommendations? The Alienist by Caleb Carr is another great historical mystery. That sounds interesting too. What's it about? It's set in 1896 New York City and follows a psychologist who investigates a series of murders. That sounds really intriguing. I might have to read it myself. It's a great book. I highly recommend it. Thanks for the recommendation. No problem. Happy to help. Can you gift wrap it for me? Of course, would you like a gift receipt as well? Yes, please. Here you go, all wrapped up and ready to go. Thank you so much, I really appreciate your help. It was my pleasure, I hope your friend enjoys the book. I'm sure she will, thanks again. You're welcome, have a great day. Dialogue 5 
book club meeting. Hey everyone, good to see you. Hey, how was everyone's month? Good, I love the book. Me too, it was a great read. What did everyone think of the ending? I thought it was a bit rushed. I agree, it could have been better. I liked it, it was unexpected. What did everyone think of the characters? I loved the main character, she was relatable. I thought the supporting characters were underdeveloped. I liked the villain, he was creepy. What's everyone planning to read next? I'm thinking of reading The Nightingale. I'm planning on reading The Vanishing Half. I'm going to read The Silent Patient. Those all sound like great choices. Has anyone read The Nightingale before? Yes, it's a great book. I've heard good things about it. What about The Vanishing Half? I haven't read it yet, but I've heard it's amazing. I read it last month, it's a must read. What about The Silent Patient? I read it last year, it's a page turner. I've been meaning to read it, thanks for the recommendation. I, I'm excited to read it. Does anyone have any other recommendations? The Immortal Life of Henrietta Lacks is a great non-fiction book. I loved The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. The Glass Castle is a great memoir. Those all sound interesting, thanks for sharing. No problem, happy to help. I can't wait for next month's meeting. Me too, it's always so much fun. Same here, see you all next month.